Hello everyone, welcome to Phasmophobia. Today, we're heading into Bleasdale and Professional. So, the Blood Moon is officially over, and they actually brought it back up a little bit. But I took a break for this weekend, and now we're getting back into it, and I had mentioned that we were going to Tanglewood on Nightmare, and we are still going to be doing that next, but first I wanted to go into a Professional map, but I saw that the weekly this month is Point Hope. So we're going to be doing the weekly on Wednesday, so I wanted to do just a nice relaxing game to kind of get back into it post Blood Moon, so we're going to be going into Bleasdale. Now the Breaker is of course in the attic, we got a cleanse, has or witness, and escape, so yeah. But I did want to mention, I went back to the tier 2 headgear, so I'm using the light again, and also I finally went back to the tier 2 dots, or not dots, the UV, I don't, I can never say what I'm thinking. Okay, also we get thunder in here. But yeah, here's the headlamp, but I also finally put on that uh, glow stick again. I've been using the tier 3 uh, UV flashlight, but the glow stick really is just the supreme. I don't know if I'm hearing stuff already. Well, I'm going to casually walk through Bleasdale. Here's a hiding spot. Now, why I wanted to get rid of the night vision, the night vision is probably better on bigger maps, and it also kind of got nerfed, so I feel like it's a very niche thing to use, and you kind of have to, like, want to use it. But I like using this kind of dimmer light, which kind of sucks for videos. But you can get away with having- whoa, what's going on here with the lighting? You can get away with having just the headlamp pretty easily, especially if you're on like a house map. Now, Bleasdale, it's pretty dark because the walls are dark, so... Is the breaker over here? I guess the light shining through is trying to tell me. I guess this light's coming from the floor below, and if that's true, that means there's a light on. Now, is there a light on in that room, or is it just this light out here that's bleeding through? Okay, I guess it's just this light. Well, I also need to remember where these cursed items are. Looks like there's nothing over here. No monkey paw either. So, I kind of thought I heard something coming up here, but I guess not. Let's close doors. Yeah, let's just go ahead and close all these doors, and then I'm going to... I thought I saw my breath. No more of these hallway ghosts up here, I'm so tired of that. Maybe we'll get a ghost on the first floor this time. Oh yes, I forgot, the whole point of me doing this was so I could walk around with my thermometer after getting the breaker on. So I guess I'll go ahead and do that now. I thought I saw a bone, and still no cursed item. See, there's lights on out here. Am I losing my mind? I guess I'm just not used to seeing that lantern over there in the corner. Alright, now this... See, there, there could be uh, more boxes here to block this, so this isn't really a true hiding spot. You can hide there, but I think the ghost has a chance of checking. Well, at this point... Oh, music box. I should be able to walk into a room. Oh, was that even a good photo? Yes. A weird one, but it was good. I should be able to walk into the room, it'd be cold enough for me to get some kind of, ooh, kind of indication, let's see. Alright, get the light on for this room. Can you give us a sign? Oh, okay, that was a sign. Get EMF on that. Oh, and you also did something else out here. Well, now that we're going back to normal, you know, phasmophobia, I do want to get photos and everything. But what about this room? I think you're roaming. Because you did something else out here. Let's get this light on. Oh, uh, yeah. Alright, I guess you're in the kitchen. So I want to walk through here. I do want to find that bone. I don't know if I'm going to get lucky, though. I didn't really look too hard for it, though, did I? I kind of hope to just get lucky. Now, I have hid here before and gotten lucky, but... Alright, no bone. So... I don't really know. When I'm not too worried about grinding money, I guess I'm not worried about getting a perfect game. But I do want to get like a full thing of photos. So, I don't know, maybe by the end here I will go looking for the bone. But I want to focus on just... Oh god, the investigation first. Please get up here. So I'll drop my stuff off and get more evidence. Also, I need to remember... I, I didn't even think... I looked in that locker. Is that locker even open? I assume it's closed because I didn't even think about it. But I have a hiding spot upstairs in that laundry room, which should be far enough away from the ghost room that it doesn't see me go in there. Alright, sanity is looking good. We need to cleanse. Well, okay, I'll just worry about all that later. Let's get evidence in here first. <laughs> I don't know, we'll save that. I want to bring the salt in with it. I'm gonna get this and set up dots for fun. 
I guess it is smart to bring the dots projector and the camera because you really should just like set up the dots and then the camera and then go back to the truck but you kind of need to know if it's going to be Gorio before you do all that where to set this up now I'm going to try and set it up oh boy it's a little hard to tell with the light on but it's coming right through here it's not hmm it's not really my favorite spot can you oh yeah now I should have had the UV can I put this on the ceiling I think you can okay how is this gonna work you know what screw it that looks pretty cool if we come through the door we will see it for a second if I stand here oh we'll definitely see it actually man putting the dots on the ceiling is a good idea Oh, you know what? I'm never getting though. Uh, see, I'm getting back into it. I <laughs> forgot about the door. Well, what about the temperature? You're still cold in here, but well, you're not down to freezing. This is perfect. Oh, oh, what'd you just do? Something over here? I don't even. Yeah, I didn't hear anything. Uh, don't tell me that's a random EMF too. <laughs> I'm just gonna try and take this like a professional game, and I'm not gonna think too much about the ghost. This is the perfect corner to set in for dots, though, because that ghost has to show up eventually if it's dots. Let's get this light off. Oh, that's not getting the light off. I'm going to get my own headlamp off. No ghost orbs, huh? I want to keep standing in the... <laughs> dots. Pretty obviously no ghost orbs, though. So where to set this up? I'm gonna set it up right here, facing the doorway. Look at, okay, with the lights off, the dots looks pretty good in here. And, uh, the book, I gotta remember what's in my inventory. Like I said, I'm just having fun playing chill phasmophobia. What? That's another, like, random EMF. I don't know if it's doing something, or I'm just not hearing what it's doing. We'll find out in the end if this is something that would give me a random EMF too. Well, huh. Let's just go get more evidence stuff to sit in here with. Okay, wow, this ghost is not draining sanity a lot. Is this like a shade? Maybe, let's just get this. Maybe we'll, well actually, that is all that's left, so. Get the salty UV and spirit box. I do love coming back to professional like this, because it's just chill phasmophobia. I know it's a weird thing, but there's always been like this chill phasmophobia, and I feel like that's what this channel is really all about, just having fun playing this game and Kind of relaxing, even though the game is terrifying. But there is time for Nightmare to go crazier, and also challenges, and whatnot. But even on professional, it can get difficult. Let's have a... Uh, let's do UV first. Okay. Okay. Did you just step right into two... I kind of wanted photos for this. What am I going to get? And there's the dots. Was that a dots photo? Okay, before I get really thrown off here, finally there's the dots. There's UV. Gorio Phantom. It's not a Gorio because we were in the same room. I don't know if I saw it again. Banshee. Is the Banshee roaming to me? That's the EMF2. See? I think the Banshee was roaming to me and that's the EMF2 I was getting. Ooh, wait, was that a photo? Oh, never mind. It's a Phantom. Look at that. See, I got a ghost photo of the dots and the dots disappeared. Okay, see, if you just take your time, sometimes you're rewarded with, like, easy stuff. We know it's a phantom, so out of curiosity, what is the phantom's other evidence? Okay, uh, I kind of knew that wasn't a hunt. I don't know, I had to, like, react and take a photo, but hey, that's why they added deleting. I knew that wasn't a hunt, but for a split second there, I kind of thought it was. Oh, okay, three-star disturbed salt? How is that even a three-star disturbed salt? Speaking of the other disturbed salt, I don't... Oh, you broke out this light. Well, at least I have the dots. Okay, turn my headlamp back on. Is this the disturbed salt I took? No. And this one's still... Fine. Now, the thing is... is... Oh, okay. Oh, look at... That. You didn't just throw that. I didn't even know this could get thrown around. <gasps> okay. I don't need another photo, thank you. Where are you? Oh, you're right here. See, it's hard to see the shadows with this headlamp. That is so cool. There's so many different things that can let you actually see where, like, the ghost is. He did an event and then just did dots from there over here. Okay. How am I on photos? I just need th three more. Let's get some defenses in here because I'm not trusting my sanity. This ghost is getting oddly aggressive. Alright, yeah. We're going down insanity. 
There's the event. So I'm gonna let him drain my sanity. Did I ever even find the cursed item? I guess I didn't. Oh no, it was the uh, music box. So I guess I could have gotten a photo with that if I needed to, but there, I'm looking for that photo, right? Oh god, that was like an awful photo, but it still counted as a three star. All right, I guess I'm not gonna worry about using that. I'm not worried about the bone either. Well, I don't know. It depends on how much time I have and how much sanity. I guess it doesn't hurt for me to just go looking for the bone at the very end now, does it? Let's focus on the game here. I'm getting smudges in. Maybe I'll just keep that. I don't really want to deal with crucifixes, although I could get easier photos. Let's get this, though, if we want easier photos. So I'll fill the book, and yeah, why not just go looking for the bone? I wish I... Well, I do have my tier 3 flashlight. I just need to pick it up. So yeah, I'll get the tier 3 flashlight at the very end, hopefully take sanity, and I'll go, like, scavenge for the bone. So what I want to do now, though, I could use the music box to drain my sanity and get a hunt, which I probably will do just for fun. Okay. Let's just try and keep track. See, so much for that. Oh, here we go. I can't keep track of anything. Turn the headlamp on. There's one photo. Now, was that... Oh, man. I don't know if that was Disturbed Salt or the footprint. Okay, it was a footprint, so then I can take a Disturbed Salt photo. And, finally, a photo of a fan. There's all three star photos. Perfect. So, now, I do want my other light before I go looking for the bone. I guess I didn't look, look over here for the bone. You don't happen to be over here, are you, bone? You're stepping again. Actually, you just went right on out. I don't need any more photos, though. I do need to drain my sanity. So, I'll tell you what. Let's go get the bone first. I'm gonna drop... I don't even know where I should drop these. I'm gonna drop two here. Let's go get my flashlight, and I will look for this bone, because I'd like to make money and get a perfect game. And it doesn't hurt for me to just walk around and look for this bone. I kind of want to take this to run around quickly, but instead I'm going to play it safe. I have three smudges in here, and I thought like these were like the lantern, and you can place them. Strange. I thought I I was trying to one time, last time, and it didn't work. Well, I'm going to scour the map. I have about 80 sanity now, because I took one. I have another one, though, if I feel like I need it. But I'm just going to scour these rooms and hopefully find this bone, because I would like to get a perfect game, and would like to make money. And would like to also show off that I can play this game properly. But it is kind of weird how you have to go looking for a bone. There, I don't know why, but like, I, th I think there used to be an idea of like, you should go looking for a dead body. Or I think people used to suggest like, there should be a dead body as like a random spawn sometimes. I don't know, I thought that was a funny idea, but I doubt it would ever happen. Well, I didn't spend too much time in here. I really need to like slow down. It's probably gonna be like on the second floor in one of the rooms I didn't really spend too much time looking in. I'm not really looking too much time in here either. I'm gonna walk out so I don't drain sanity. I wanna look at the second floor because I really didn't look around in those rooms too much and actually I didn't check the bathroom, the other bathroom. So there's rooms up there I need to go look in more. I bet it's on the second floor. Could have always been out here, but no, I never went in here. So what are the odds it's in the one room is that the bone or just some hmm, cloth on the floor? I thought that was like part of the bone. I thought there were like two drains in there. So, okay, I guess I didn't get lucky. No bone in here. Oh, nope, that's not it either. Okay, I'm getting excited. Come on. I don't want to spend too much time here, but like, I'm professional. I'm forgetting like. It goes to kind of a bit more calm. I am draining sanity by going into these rooms though, and not turning the light on. I don't know how much it's actually affecting me though. Oh well, look, at least I'm looking. But if I don't find it, I guess I won't make a big deal out of it. But I do want to look for the bone at least. Oh, I never look in here though. I thought I did a more thorough job of looking around. Turn on the light. Scan the room slowly. And of course, <laughs> I don't see anything. Okay, my last option, did I look in here? I'm pretty sure I did, but of course, that doesn't mean I would have found it. Okay, well, I didn't look in the, at oh, the attic too much, and I didn't turn on the light to the attic, did I? Hmm, this is my last hope. And, oh, and it of course was just 
chilling up here. Okay, don't need a photo, but got the bone. Now, I don't know about sanity, but I do have this, and I kind of want to use it to, like, get away during a hunt. But, I mean, all the smudges are, like, the smarter idea. But I guess you, if you got hunted, you could just, like, switch to this, take it, and just bolt right on out of there. What am I going to have in my inventory? At least one smudge, and I don't have a lighter. Did I ever even pick up the lighter? See, that's my problem. I don't think I even picked up the lighter. And I swear, when I grabbed these smudges, I tried to pay attention and pick up the lighter, but I never did. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna go do that. Yep, and there's the lighter sitting here. Okay, well, the last thing we will do here is have some fun with the music box. Because I do want to, like, have fun with Professional. And, you know, I do want to try and make money, but, like, Professional is my way of kind of playing around with the cursed items more. So let's do that. I don't need to take a photo. But I... <laughs> I don't want to start it too close. I'm not going to take a photo. We're just going to see if the ghost likes this music. Or if he kills me from right off the bat. See, here he comes. Oh, see, he likes the music box. Oh, wow. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, it's a phantom, so I can't see him. Oh, my God. Turn, turn that off. I'm going to, like... No, 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 oh, my lights, all oh, my lights are on. I don't, I don't think I have the other smudge. I only picked up the two. Somehow, he didn't detect my lights. I forgot I had my headlamp on the whole time. I get my headlamp mixed up with my area light. Like right now, you can see this little light. I get that light mixed up with my headlamp light. If he had seen me at the doorway there, I'm, I was dead. This is why I like having fun, though, with the uh, cursed items and just doing stuff. Doing stupid stuff with the hunts. And just having fun with the maps. I like hiding in spots I've never really hid in a lot, and this is one of them. Mainly because I feel like it's always busted or closed. Well, there's a stupid hunt survived. Alright, and it was definitely a phantom. You gotta be careful hunting a phantom, or during a phantom's hunt. He was invisible, and like right after he was done using the music box, he like just disappeared. So I have a question. My sanity... How do you tell if one of these has been used? That's another thing. Okay, one looks like all disgusting and one looks all shiny, that's how. What did... I heard a light. Did you, you didn't just do this one. Maybe you did the light in your room. It, no, you probably did. But the thing is, it's broken out, man. So sanity is probably, oh no, it definitely is still gone from the music box. Give us a sign. Richard Brock, Dick Brock, come on, show us a sign. Show us yourself. Don't show us your Richard. Well, I wanted to see if I could get some angry responses here under the glow of this ominous dots projector. Is anyone here? Do I have all the objectives? I do. All objectives. Man, this ghost went dormant. Come on, Richard. I know you're here. Give us a sign. I wonder what those... Can the Phantom also do a 2 EMF? I think the Banshee, the Phantom, and the... Wraith can do a 2 EMF. So maybe the Phantom was doing it. The Phantom will... I don't even remember at this point. It's all in my head. But I gotta remember it. I just need to play this game enough to actually start remembering some of the little details. Alright, we're in the pitch black here, Richard. I want to get hunted by you, and not in an awful way. I did take sand... Nitty. You know, when I was running away during that hunt. But, oh, oh. But I don't think... I'm, I'm above hunt range. Oh, what? Some of these throws, that one was really jittery. Trying to fry me up something. I know you're here. Oh, no, there are lights on. I thought the breaker was out. Let me turn the light on in here. I've been talking to Richard this whole time. Too bad I can't use the music box again. It's out here. There it is. Come on, Richard. Show me you're powerful. Throw something, even though you kind of just did. I really wonder about my sanity. What's over here? Oh, it's a cup you throw. 
through over here. There's all kinds of bug spray and stuff sitting out. Well, if you don't want to do anything, I guess I'll just have to leave. Oh, no, he doesn't want me to leave. I don't. Just hunt me. Come on. Do I really need to step outside and see what my sanity is? I'm willing to do that. It doesn't matter, though. I've been in... I've been in the dark. And this guy... I don't know. When you look at a phantom, I wonder if my sanity drains more when you're looking at him during a dots. Because I think... Isn't that how a phantom works when you're looking at it directly? When it manifests itself, your sanity drains a lot quicker? So I wonder if that happens during a dots for a phantom. Come on, Richard. I want one more hunt. Well, <laughs> look at that. How have I been sitting in the dark so much and I'm still above hunt range? Okay, let's sit in the dark a little bit longer and then I guess I'll get another hunt here. I never really noticed these tier 3 smudges. I know I just unlocked them, but I didn't, I, these all go grody for some reason and there's like red on the inside. I don't know exactly how these work in real life. I kind of remember the priest smudging in the church <laughs> when I was a kid. I wonder if it smells anything like that stuff did. Are you in here? I wish you hadn't broken out that light. I wanted to leave this light off for dramatic purposes. So I want to leave it pitch black in here just to keep it creepy. I'm gonna turn off my headlamp. Yeah, there we go, dumbass. Turn off your headlamp and just use your main light. I need to remember to do that during hunts. I heard you in here. Oh, oh, never mind. You came back in here. How do I get this guy to drain my sanity I'm I want to play around with these tier 3 smudges more as well I mean I'm getting used to smudging and protecting myself during a hunt but these are <laughs> okay I guess you're not writing <laughs> as if we didn't know that oh you know what are you here are you friendly yeah, I put down my defenses <laughs> are you here okay See? That did it. It's like the ghost knew. Oh god. This is like the worst idea ever. Trying to deal, do this with a phantom. Look at him! He's so invisible. And he's just throwing that same spoon. Alright. Don't get stuck in the door. Look at the trees. And then get in this corner. Alright. That's another thing. Hunting up. Getting him. No. 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 I can't believe, at this point, this ghost is going to check every room in the house to try and find me. Getting hunted by a phantom is scary though, because you, you really don't see the ghost, but it is pretty obvious. So when it's a phantom, like... Oh, come on, please. You, you have no reason to spend more time in this room. I mean, I know I did smudge you out here. Yeah, it's pretty obvious when you get a phantom, so that's kind of like an easier one to help you determine a ghost if you're like on a no evidence run. Oh, okay, he did not want me to leave, but guess what, dude, I am actually officially out of here, so we're gonna close that and we're gonna get out of here. My heart is still beating in my head even though I'm out of here. I, I'm so scared from that ghost event. That one event is just so scary compared to everything else, my heart is still beating in my head. Yeah, it looks like an EMF-5, but I think that was from the ghost event. <laughs> the okay there it goes it finally went away yeah obviously a phantom 1500 now a couple dailies but still 1300 without those dailies so you know what it is worth it for me to just like walk around and look for the bone especially on a small map i'll just you know i cut out most of it usually because it's just me looking around but there we go that was a fun little bleasdale game to get me back into just like the regular fo flow of phasmophobia so like i said Next time, we're going to be getting back into Nightmare and going to Tanglewood for the first time in a while. So if you're still here, thank you so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time.